Hey, Adria. Mi uh -huh. is Days Dávila. From Puerto Rico. From Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico en la casa. Puerto Rico en la casa. I love it. <laughs> Congratulations on Blink Twice. You know, you have been having a great year. It's been a great year. It's seen you know, a lot of productions. That's good. Um, how do you approach playing Sarah? Especially, you know, it, this film has an intense and mysterious atmosphere. Um, yeah, Sarah was a Sarah was a challenge for me for sure. You know, every every element of this movie when I first read it, I it, it kind of scared me, and it's the reason why I really wanted to do it in the first place. Um, and kind of her arc is completely the opposite of what I've sort of played before. Um, mm -hmm. So that was interesting. And I think there's so many elements to this movie where characters are going through such high emotions and also through a lot of substances. They're drunk, they're high, they're, I don't know what's going on, they're confused, they're scared. There's so many things happening to these characters at all moments of this film that that was a big challenge to sort of navigate through all of that and try to braid that into a performance. Um, yeah, it was it was hard but really rewarding. I, I I can tell I can tell. So how do you work with with Zoe Kravitz on you know mixing all these elements into Sarah? Since it was a big challenge for you. Um, you know, I think you have your sort of performance and your artistry is very much to yourself and then through your director is sort of your guide and your leader through it but I think tonally Zoe is did such an impeccable job of making sure that we all tonally sort of coincide and and mm -hmm. and you know I think she's she's a brilliant director you know we we spoke about the scenes quite a lot and I could see her brain or or or, or could sense sort of what she was looking for out of me and and I try to deliver as close as I could as possible. Um, she's really specific as a director and really empathetic. And she sort of shape shifts her 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 direction depending on the actor that she's talking to. You know, she's an actress and has been in our shoes, so really knows how to talk to to actors. And that's great. And this this is her first director movie, right? She's this is the first time. He's directing, so that's great to hear. Yeah. Um, talk, talk to me about the, the the film experience behind the scenes, you know, with the production team, with your cast members. How was that chemistry? Oh, it was it was great. You know, we all lived together in this in the hacienda that we filmed. We were actually living there. So like I I would sometimes be watching a movie in my room and so the sound department would come up to me and be like, Hey, can you lower your volume? We could hear it. That's how close we all were. You know, we would have breakfast, lunch, and dinner together and, and just hang out. We were in the pool that we shot is the pool that we would use. Like, there was a tiny little gym right there. Um, one of the, all the rooms that we shot in, that's what our rooms look like. That's, that's where we lived. Um, so it was a really immersive experience. And I'm just really, really grateful that everybody was vetted and everyone was just so cool. Like Zoe vetted everybody and, and everyone was just so cool. There's no egos involved and we all just had a really great time. You know, it's, it's really important when you're doing a movie like this for the group to be sort of symbiotic because we are going to really dark places and, and exploring really strange emotions. So you want to feel safe. And that's exactly what I felt. The whole time. Good. Great, great answer. Well, Adria, my time is up. Thank you so yeah, much. Yeah, because I spoke no. so much. I'm so sorry. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's okay. Estamos bien orgullosos de ti. Gracias. Gracias. Los quiero Puerto Rico.